Hey, this is Mirgloff, and this is the Tez Fan Server. Uh, I'm calling it that instead of the BGSF Minecraft Server, simply because uh, our community lately has been more revolved not so much around the Bethesda community forums. But uh, what we're at right now is a height map generated uh, scale map of uh, Tamriel. Uh, which is the world setting of the Elder Scrolls games. And right now this is the Imperial City. Or, you know, the generic land for the Imperial City. And, uh, this map was generated today and I figured I would uh, record that. I want to find out uh, which way is east. That way is west. I'm going to go east to Morrowind. Simply because that's what interests me the most. I, I believe the plan for this map is to... Uh, sort of like there's the uh, Middle Earth rebuilding thing. I forget what it's called, but I think that's what uh, Mr. Tank Jump has in mind, is to have us rebuild the entire actual game world within Minecraft. So it's sort of a uh, the Elder Scrolls cons uh, not reconstruction, construction project. I'm sure someone will uh, come up with a better name for that. But, uh, I'm mostly interested at the, immediately in building Balmora, which is a one of the starter towns. Not really a starter town, but it's a town that you get sent to in Morrowind. These must be the mountains. And uh, right now, all the terrain is just grass and dirt. I don't know how they're going to handle biomes specifically. In fact, I want to ask Tank that. I think I'm leaving Cyrodiil now. And I'm just going to mostly be observing the terrain. I mean, there isn't really much to comment on, so, you know, this video is probably only going to be any interest to anyone who just wants to see how the uh, the map generation turned out. Like I said, if we used a, uh, uh, what's it called, a uh, height map, I believe they took it from maybe Skyrim, because I think Skyrim is the game that had the entire map of Tamriel height map within the game itself at least the files oh this is not right these kind of things I believe are going to be Problems, okay, so he's aware of that. Okay, so this is a rough draft. So this isn't the final product, I guess. Still, it's pretty cool to go through this.
I must be in Morrowind already. I'm looking for Vardenfell, which is the island. In fact, I'm going to uh, pull up the dine map for myself so I can tell where I am. Yep, I'm just, I'm pretty close to uh, Vardenfell. And I'll I'll post a uh, a link in the video description on how to find this uh, the dynamic map for this map. And most of more the Morrowind province within the Tamriel map has been discovered already, or explored within the dynamic map. Also, uh, we're pretty close to uh, Bedrock with the uh, the map here. They had to generate the oceans at a low level in order to get the uh, the mountains to be at a uh, reasonable height and accurate height. And a result of which... Uh, the uh, side effect is that ores cannot be generated. Ores or caves can't be naturally generated, so... I wonder if I've passed it. No, I must be here. Oh, immediately mountains? It's curious. Gotta check the dynamic map again. Okay. Okay, I was following the uh, channel. I need to go east more. Perhaps this is uh, Vardenfell. No, it's not. I need to go this way. I was going north, by mistake. So, not everything is perfect with this map generation. Uh, right here is a... Uh, a hole. This is supposed to be filled by something. Some generation that didn't happen. I was in the Black Marsh before I got teleported here, and there were some pretty interesting hills. I'm going to actually head back there. It was east, so... This direction. The Black Marsh is supposed to be swampy. I mean, there's no biome specific to uh, this map as yet, so apparently it's a rough draft. So I still don't know how uh, Mr. Tank Jump's going to handle that, but uh, I just wanted to show the uh, the hills over in the Black Marsh, as they're uh, they they're really good looking hills, and uh, you'll just have to see and believe me. And the rain does not help. But it's going to be quite a bit of uh, traveling across this uh, water, so... So here is the the hills I was talking about, and I really like how these look. It's something you can tell is done with some sort of height map generation. I mean, if you go up, it looks sort of like the... I think it's topographical maps, 
you see of how mountains are done on uh, maps. They sort of have those circles. Also in uh, ocean charts. But it has the perception of being smooth when you're in this sort of position. And I've never seen uh, in any kind of uh, map generation naturally like this in Minecraft. It's so very intriguing to me. And this right here is the Black Marsh area. It's hard to tell from just looking at it like this. But, you know, it's very interesting. It'd be cool to have, like, the lower channel parts. You can't see them yet. But I'm going to get towards there where the, uh, uh, check the dyne map and sort of describe what I'm looking at. Okay, I'm not on one of the, uh, the Arpichel, Arp I can't say that word very well, Apachalegos or whatever. So, which is a bunch of uh, islands, and they start off as hills. They have like they're hilly in the center, but they all lead down to a bunch of rivers and connected streams, very similar to how the uh, the Amazon functions. I don't know if that's intentional, if uh, the Black Marsh is supposed to emulate the Am Amazon river and jungles somewhat. If I follow this coastline, I should return to the Imperial Providence of Cyrodiil. But uh, I don't think there's really too much more of the show. I could go to each province and landmark. Well, not landmark, but there's no landmarks. But I could go to each provincial areas and sort of figure out where the... Uh, what significant landmarks there are. I don't believe I was recording at the time because I was on Skype with someone, but I, I did find Balmora, and it looks pretty accurate. The Odai River was dry, however, but uh, that has more to do with uh, the level of what water was intended to generate. The Odai would have been uh, higher that than that, and then Y axis is it Y? It's not X. Let's see here. The the Z axis was oh, okay. It's Y. The Y axis did not of the Odai River does not correlate with the ocean level, and with how Minecraft generates, it it isn't exactly compatible. Anyways, thanks for watching, and I will definitely be. Uh, making updates of this as progress is made when they I suppose a uh, a more finished map is generated where there's biomes and stuff and when we actually begin to build monuments on the uh, the Tamriel map I'll definitely be making videos of this to document it I suppose is the word I was looking for thanks for watching see you later